welcome to another edition of Tactical Gear Magazine TV. I'm Dave Morelli, and today we have a real treat. We have one of McMillan's TAC-308 rifles that we're going to run through the paces. We're going to shoot right now. We're going to shoot 100-yard groups with it, and we're using this uh, Black Hills Gold ammunition. It's seeded with uh, 180 grain Nosler AccuTip bullets. Uh, I've used this before in, in several other rifle tests. It's really, really accurate am ammunition. So we have a good treat today. This is a sweet rifle, and we're going to digest some ammo in it. Some of the features of this rifle is first off, it's bedded in a high quality McMillan stock. Um, it's a composite stock. This one has an adjustable cheek piece. It has adjustable length of pull. Uh, it's a magazine fed gun, holds five in the magazine. It also comes and it's attached to the fore end of the stock, a rail system with uh, two side rails and a top rail for night optics. The end of the barrel has a threaded cap on it. Should you need a suppress, suppressed weapon, uh, it's threaded and ready to go with a suppressor. This one here, uh, as a demo, came with a U.S. optical scope. It's a three and a half to 17 power scope and it's crystal clear. One of the things I really like about this stock is the fat pistol grip. It's stippled for a good grip and uh, the fat grip fits me the best. It also has a very robust trigger guard, an aluminum trigger guard, and right in front of it, at your fingertip, is the magazine release, and it pops right out really easy. The action on this rifle is extremely well fitted and smooth. The trigger weighed in at two and a half pounds, and it's as crisp as a cold October morning. Well, here's some of the groups we shot today. This one here was our first group, and that was right out of a clean, that was right out of a clean bore. And we got two shots that are half minute, and then one that flew a little. Uh, the second group we threw, uh, these two are right in the same hole, and then I, I must have pulled that one. Can't blame that on the rifle. Here's another three shot group that's looking pretty good. And then the last group we shot was this one here. All three of them are in a half a minute. And uh, with a little adjustment over here to the, to the center, we're ready to go out on the long range and shoot at seven, eight, nine, a thousand yards. As the distances get further and further away, um, I've been depending on a little pocket calculator PC like this one here to uh, figure out my range estimation. I downloaded a ballistic program from Night Force in here and Night Force's program allows me to uh, calculate trajectory, windage, and I can even program wind direction and all those, all that information I can put in here and it'll tell me what my corrections are. Now that I got this McMillan tack sighted in at 100 yards, I want to try to shoot it a little further. Today I'm going to shoot at 500 yards. I have a 10 inch gong here from MGM Targets. This is going to be my target for today. Most, most of the shoots that I go to use steel targets like this gong here. What I'm going to do first though is I'm going to work on this big target and see where she's hitting. And this is 10 inches in here, so at 500 yards if I can keep them in here, theoretically I should be able to hit uh, this 10 inch gong. With the McMillan TAC 308 and we have a thousand yard gong set up out there. We're gonna take a couple of pokes at it with this Black Hills gold ammo. I've punched all my information for the wind and the angle and the distance into the Night Force program and I need 19.75 minutes of correction for elevation. The wind is going on and off on me so um, I'm going to try to shoot when the wind isn't blowing, or if it does, I'm just going to correct it with the lines in the scope because it's, it's not much. It's 
two to three miles an hour. So with that said, let's get rolling on this. We'll see if we can hit that thing. Well, there it is, a first round hit with the TAC 308 rifle from McMillan's, 1,000 yard gongs. Looked like I hit the right side of the gong. Um, this wind's been a swirling around, but it looks like first round hit, now it's just a matter of mastering the wind, but uh, all the calculations from the Night Force program and the PDA all worked out just right. Thanks for joining us for another edition of Tactical Gear Magazine TV. If you're uh, interested or your mission calls for a high quality precision rifle such as the McMillan TAC 308 then you definitely need to take a look at it. Uh, it shoots extraordinary groups at 100 yards and as you can see we can keep them dancing at a thousand also. Uh, this rifle is definitely worth taking a look at. I was very impressed with it.